Hello Lolas, welcome back to my channel guys. If you're new to this channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And if you're not a part of the channel membership, I am asking you to check us out. There are two tiers. The first tier is $1.99 and it's just for up updates and uh, video uploads. Um, and then the second tier is for $4.99. That's where I'll be doing majority of my live streams. It's little mini vlogs here and there, my day, day to day routines, um, the, uh, you know, a lot of hot topic, uh, videos will be in there as well as, um, a few paint and chat videos that type of stuff but um it'll just be a wide mix of things um and if you cannot join the paid channel membership just know that you're also still appreciated on the gym pop and you are still a valuable lola so today i am going to reintroduce to you guys baby calvin and so without further ado, I'm not going to do the whole just spill. <laughs> I'm just going to just take the camera right on to this baby. Some of you guys may be familiar with this baby. Some of you guys may not. I don't think he spent a lot of time on my channel before because he was a custom painted baby um for Linda um with Birdie's baby um Birdie's baby reborn sorry I'm trying to get the light where it's not like too too much on him like washing him out but anyway um nevertheless uh so this baby was in her nursery and of course I was able to get him back um, and this was the very first custom like order she did with me um, she was just like oh I just you know want you to you know paint him whatever whatever she wanted a Lanny sculpt and um, she she was so excited when she got him she sent me a shirt it came straight from the company that she had it made and it I think it says I'm a doll artist and it had his picture on it and I wear I wear it um often actually um so I've worn it so much to starting to get a little bit of fade to it um I can't even remember I should have had the thing when I made this baby for her it might have been in 2020 uh might have been two years ago so um anyway she she really loved him and um I was I was really 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 making sure that if I didn't get anyone else back that I got him back um so and just so you guys know um I've been posting on my Facebook I've been posting on my stories I've been posting on my wall um Linda um which is Linda Plummer uh and she's also Rikuchi on um Instagram had probably about a hundred babies or so reborn silicones BJDs um she even have a bear collection she has quite a bit of a collection so right now it's been almost a year we're we're working up to a year now um she passed in the beginning of December and um so now her husband is starting to get her her collection sold, you know, minus the ones that he's, of course, going to hang on for himself um, that she, you know, some of the ones she really, really loved the most, of course. Um, I think she loved them all, but you know what I mean. Um, so um it's quite a bit it's an overwhelming amount for someone to go through someone's collection not really knowing what's what you know and trying to piece together the the coas and 
you know, matching the COAs to the doll and, you know, some, you know, you got to find who the artist is and this and that. So I've been trying to help uh, with that part. Um, and well, not the well, yeah, the matching, but I'm doing it virtually. Um, but you know, there's someone there physically there, a friend of the family is there trying to, um, match everything up together. And so, um, I'm asking everybody to kind of spread the word that her collection is being sold. And what I, what I've been trying to make everyone aware of is that you know when we take pictures you know and I'm just speaking in general they may you know do the job for us as collectors and stuff um, but keep in mind that there are a lot of her dolls that are very much amazing high quality dolls but the photos may be a little dark or may not be showing as much of the detail. So um, you guys could actually get some really beautiful babies. Um, I am suggesting that you, if you see a baby or a sculpt that you really like, especially like the sold out ones like the Sally's and the um, Grayson by Bonnie Brown. She has, you know, Benjamin, not Benjamin, she has, a, uh, what's it, Benjamin? uh susu um just different ones she has babies from people from all over the world um also check out her channel her youtube channel um and you can see quite a bit of her dolls there and she talks about the artists and all this and stuff now being that it's an estate sale um a lot of the stuff is not all together so pretty much they're gonna be like in a blanket with you know their coas and and stuff like that some of them may come with you know some stuff as she'd be able to get to getting some some clothing and stuff put together in some of the boxes but also the dolls are are being sold considerably at a lower price um for that reason and you know of course they're all second hand um but you know, linda kept her babies in immaculate condition um I um, I can actually vouch for that um, and so um, I can't vouch for every single doll of course but you know what I've seen and also from people that have gotten dolls so far from um, this sale have said that you know the hair might be disheveled and you have to brush the hair and all that and stuff but it's not they're not like damaged or anything like that and if anything is going on um i trust that uh that will be disclosed i have been serving as a buffer buffer but if you you know message um uh, if you're on facebook or you're on ebay and you see the dolls and you message her directly uh lindy is helping um that's perfectly okay too um i just you know trying to help but I also have my business to run here as well. You know, I have a lot going on, of course, myself with all the platforms and stuff that I have to deal with and trying to complete my babies to get sold. But um, I'm here to help if I can. Um, I'm not going to help you shop for a baby. <laughs> um, but I will, you know, if you have a question or a price, I can get that for you. I can connect you to who you need to get connected to, that type of thing. Um, so I just, you know, want to say that a couple people have actually messaged me and was like, can you look and point out a couple? And I don't have time to do that. Honestly, I really don't. I, I wish I had that kind of time, but I don't, um, I I'm on online and I'm on and right back off cause I'm trying to root this baby and you know, I just have a lot going on. So anyway, um, Lanny was not painted with this tummy plate okay it's just so funny um this tummy plate is actually my lulu slash laura um uh tummy plate and it it matched with him um pretty pretty darn good the color is 
almost spot on, which is so crazy. Like, I was just like, wow. Um, so I do repeat colors. Uh, he has different undertones, like the hands and feet is painted differently from um, my Lulu baby. But uh, it still, it still works. Um, so it, the skin tone is spot on and which this tummy plate, believe it or not, is a little, um, I don't know. Well, maybe not, but anyway, it, it worked. And so I was like, Hey, I actually like it better with him than I do, uh, uh, my, uh, Lulu because he's a bigger baby so i said oh well i guess they'll both kind of share for photos or whatever but he'll probably wear it a lot um because it really works for him but um he's very cuddly and he's on my signature body i had forgot about that but he is on a signed body so that's pretty cool and um so i'm you know i'm just excited to get get him back and um this he will be a part of my forever collection um this baby means a lot to me there's so much you know of the stories that we had that we uh shared in the process with this this little guy and it's kind of how i really kind of started uh the transactions between me and her as far as you know seller and buyer and then we developed a friendship from there um so it was bittersweet getting him back um i just cannot believe that it's been um almost a year already it just feels like it just was yesterday almost um except for you know you miss you know i miss the crazy posts and stuff like that but i i do not want to you know Go down that, that, I don't want to, you know, stir up that part. But, um, yeah, so, you know, um, like I said, this video is just to share that he's back. I'm going to keep the name that she named him, which was Calvin. And so he's going to be my Calvin. And um, it's funny because she used to always say, um, he tell me he's not going nowhere unless he come back to you. And um, so here he is. I wish it was under be better circumstances, but um, he's here. And so um, you guys, I guess I I can share him a lot, lot because he will not, not go anywhere. I'm going to have to start finding what clothes I have for him and stuff. And I may even send him off to get here uh, next year. Um, if I if I can, I'm, I'll probably will go ahead and get him rooted too, because um, he's not gonna go anywhere. She liked him ball though. She really liked him ball, um, but I am gonna probably go ahead and get him some hair. Um, really love this kid. I fell in love with him. I love the second one that I just did. Uh, they're two different skin tones though, um, so. Um, but. I actually love both of them the same. I was sitting here trying to think like which one I like the most. I actually love them both actually um, probably about the same. Um, but anyway, I don't want this to be such a low vibration video. Um, I have a lot, a lot going on. Um, I, I have quite a bit of babies, new babies, um, in my nursery, so I gotta start making room, and so I still have a cuddle that's gonna be, that's available for sale, um, that one is $900 shipped, I am working on a full body and cuddle with hands, um, that will also be available um and then also a actual just a cuddle um uh, baby that probably eh, it probably will be in my personal collection um but you know 
Uh, so, yeah, so lots of things coming up, guys. Um, like I said, if you, you know, are looking for Reborn, she has painted hair ones, rooted hair ones, um, ball ones, BJDs. Um, there's so, a silicones. She has silicones from, most of her silicones are from, um, uh, Doris, but she does have one that I painted, which was Lola, um, which is Lola by Christina Vassal. And that was the fourth silicone that I had painted. Um, it's one of the darkest skin tones that I've painted to date. Um, and I really love that one. Um, I think she came out really nice. Uh, I think that was my first time rooting a silicone baby. Um, but, you know, um, and then she also have the Anne Wong. I call it Anne, Anne, what I call it? I call it Anne Hung, but it's, I think it's Anne Wong, Wang, something like that. I don't know. Um, she has that one that is, has a drinking wet, um, it's a boy and have armatures and arms and legs, have squishy tummy type thing going on. Um, it is, I think it's number one out of five, The Wake, um, which is on video. If you want to go look at the video from the actual sculptor, um, you could see that baby there. Now that one is going to be fairly priced as well. So if you're looking for a full body with a drinking wet, um, it is a Caucasian baby. Um, it's really cute. Then, you know, uh, let me know um, or let Lindy know. Um, so, yeah, so it's, it's, uh, she has a lot. <laughs> so. Um, anyway, what else did I have to say? But that's it. That's all I have to say. You know, like I said, it's just a great way to get an affordable baby, um, that's high end at a great cost and yeah. So I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.